Bear Island is the largest of the seven West Cork Islands and we've got just under 200 full-time residents. I'm Helen Riddell, I work with Bear Island Projects Group, a community group which was set up on Bear Island and a huge part is documenting and preserving our heritage for future generations. Being part of ICANN will allow us to reach out to the island diaspora in all four corners of the world. We've got Bear Islanders living in Argentina, in North America, in Australia, all throughout Europe. We regularly get contacted by people tracing their ancestors. We had a database of old photographs, we've mapped our island graveyard, and now through joining ICANN, it's allowed us to actually digitise all the graveyard mapping. When we started the Oral History Project in 2022, a group of islanders came together to record the oral history. So this is documented for future generations. Our ICANN website for Bear Island is basically set up in three distinct areas, people, places, and topics. The people will obviously um, include our oral history project. Places will reference to all the various historical heritage places around the island, the archeological sites, the Standing Stone, the Wedge Tomb, and all the military batteries. And then topics, there'll be specific um, events such as we did an event a couple of years ago to mark centenary of the Bear Island internment camp. Last year, we marked the treaty ports. Being on an island, we can be geographically isolated, but now that we're part of a larger network, it's great to share our stories, our history, our information. The team at ICANN have been fantastic. They've been there to help us throughout the whole process. This website, it's for the future of Bear Island to ensure there is a future of the island and it's for future generations so they can see what life was like on the island. In joining the Irish Community Archive Network, it's a great opportunity for Bear Island Projects Group to spread our heritage and our history throughout the world.